And we are at the Exotic Animal Collection Day. This is an amnesty program of the state. And Dennis, uh, you've been overseeing this whole endeavor. Had you any idea what you would be expecting? We had a lot of calls leading up to today, but the response is more than we imagined. We're uh, close to the end of the day, but we already have about 130 animals that have come in. And uh, there's still more time to go, so uh, it's, a, it's a good number. What, now, what does your department do with all of these collected animals? Clearly, there are too many for the zoo. Yep, we're working with Beardsley and other uh, licensed zoological facilities uh, to place these animals in you know, settings that can handle them, uh, facilities that are licensed, for instance, to handle reptiles or, or birds. So we have a network of, of places we deal with as we've had to take possession of exotic animals over the years. Uh, so we put out the call and, and people are ready to take these animals in. 135 animals brought in for Exotic Animal Amnesty Day at the Beardsley Zoo in Bridgeport, Connecticut. I'm David Smith for DoingItLocal.com and for iReporter at CNN.